Hebrews chapter 10 verses 5 to 10 Behold, I come to do your will. For this reason, when he came into the world, he said, Sacrifice and offering you did not desire, but a body you prepared for me. Holocaust and sin offerings you took no delight in. Then I said, As it is written of me in the scroll, Behold, I come to do your will, O God. First, he says, sacrifices and offerings, holocaust and sin offerings, you neither desire nor delight in. These are offered according to the law. Then he says, behold, I come to do your will. He takes away the first to establish the second. By this will, we have been consecrated through the offering of the body of Jesus Christ once for all. In reading this passage, don't you get the feeling that this is a conversation between the Father and the Son on the eve preceding Jesus' birth in Bethlehem? It was God who prepared a body for us all. God himself said in Jeremiah 1, 5, Before I formed you in the womb, I knew you, and before you were born, I consecrated you. Even the first Adam didn't become a living soul until God blew the breath of life into him. Now the second Adam, the human part of Jesus, who was born in Bethlehem, will have the breath of life given to him by the Father. Now the first sacrificial system is gone and has been replaced by the new covenant's perfect sacrifice, Jesus.